What is up guys? Welcome back for today's video. Update ko lang kayo about sa procedure kung saan itinuro ko po sa inyo kung paano masasolusyonan ang problemang your account is already registered to another phone. Napansin ko kasi sa chat with Gigi na nag-iba na naman yung process niya. So I decided to make this video para ma-update kayo. But before we continue this tutorial, bawa pa lang sa inyong channel, niling ko pa ang inyong mga may para isubscribe ang channel na ito. And don't forget to hit the notification bell para lagi kang updated every time na mag-upload ako ng mga panibagong videos. And without further ado, let's get started. So ngayon, nandito kasi yung screen. Ang una lang natin gagawin is syempre, pupunta tayo sa Chrome or any browser na available sa inyong mga phone. Then search lang natin dito yung Gcash Help Center. Then go natin. Then punta tayo dito sa Gcash Help Center. Then scroll up, scroll down lang natin hanggang lumabas si Chat with Gigi. Then pindutin natin yan, Chat with Gigi. Then ngayon, lagay lang natin dito as first message yung phone registration. Then send natin. Then sasabihin ni Gigi na ganito, Seems like you have a concern regarding phone registration or account secure. What best describe your concern? Click natin tong I'm getting the prompt you already have a registered phone. Then mag-respond si Gigi na ganito, If you still have access to your registered phone, follow the instructions below. So ito yung mga steps na pwede natin gawin if may access pa tayo sa ating old phone. Since wala na tayong access sa ating old phone dahil nawala na ito or nasira na, tatanungin tayo, are you able to log in? Click natin tong no. Then sasabihin ni Gigi na ganito, alright, which best describes your concern? Click natin tong I forgot to remove or unregister my old phone. Then sasabihin ni Gigi, no worries, we will assist you in unregistering your old phone so you can log into your account with your new phone. For your security, we will be asking for a few more details before you can proceed. So click natin tong show form, then may pipil upan tayong form. Ilalagay natin dito yung Gcash registered name, Gcash registered mobile number, Gcash registered email address, and yung phone's brand and model. Dito sa phone's brand and model, ilalagay lang natin yung brand and model ng ating old phone na nasira na. After nating ma-fill up an yung form, click lang natin tong send. Then return to chat. Then mag-respond si Gigi na ganito. Thanks Raymart, please provide the required documents for us to process your request. So need natin ng valid ID used to register with Gcash and ito yung mga list na yon. And yung selfie with your valid ID. So ibig sabihin, need natin i-upload yung valid ID tsaka yung selfie with our valid ID dito. Then dito sa baba, please upload a valid ID you used to register with Gcash. Then select natin tong file para ma-upload natin yung valid ID natin. Click lang natin ulit yung select file. Then media picker. Then upload lang natin yung valid ID natin. After natin ma-select yung file, click lang natin tong submit file. Then may nakalagay dito file successfully uploaded. So na-upload na siya, return to chat na tayo. Then dito, please upload a selfie with your valid ID. So need din natin i-upload yung selfie with our valid ID. Select file lang ulit. Then media picker. Then submit file. Then return to chat. Then mag-response ngayon si Gigi ng ganito. Here's your ticket number. So, bibigyan tayo ng ticket number. For your security, we will be checking your submitted docs or documents. Once validated, an email will be sent within 24 hours confirming that you should be able to log into your account with your new phone already. So ngayon need natin i-monitor yung email natin dahil doon mag email si Gcash for updates regarding sa status ng ating ticket. Back home tayo, then punta lang tayo sa... After few minutes, mag email si Gcash ng ganito. Hi Raymar, thank you for reaching out to Gcash support. This is to acknowledge your step of your concern. We will get back to you within 24 to 48 hours. Thank you. Regards, Gcash support. So ngayon need lang natin mag-wait ng 24 to 48 hours for updates. And take note, merong mga cases na lumalagpas. Merong 3 days, merong 4 days. Depende po sa case. Kaya need nyo lang mag-stick doon sa first ticket nyo. Dahil doon po mag-respond si Gcash. Ibig sabihin, kahit marami po kayong ticket na in-open, iwawalang visa po yan ni Gcash. Once na meron na po kayong na-open na ticket, yun na po mismo yung i-consider ni Gcash. And after that, makakarsive kayo ng email from Gcash kung saan i-confirm niya na na-unlink na yung old phone nyo. And pwede nyo nang i-register yung new phone. So hanggang dito lang video na ito. Sana katulong. Have a nice day. Thank you and goodbye. Peace out.